What's up, everybody? Demetrius Miner coming right back at you with yet another hot sauce review. Um, today, I am very excited because a friend of mine, shout out to Kim Zuber, um, got me a hot sauce during his trip to Portugal. So this is going to be a very special review. And here it is. Bandido Piri Piri Sauce. Um, I love the label. This label looks amazing. Uh, I love the color. It's like a bright orange. Uh, just looks phenomenal. Um, it is, they got two. Um, right here, if you can see it, they got two out of five on their heat scale. Um, so let's go ahead and jump into um, the ingredients here. All right, ingredients. Agua, pimento, formello, piri piri, uh, vermello, sal, and it looks like this is written in Spanish here. Oh, they got the English version. Let me let me go with what I know for sure. All right, ingredients, water, red pepper, red piri-piri, salt, spices, thickener, in parentheses, xanthan gum, acidity regulator, which is citric acid, uh, preservatives such as sodium and natural lemon flavor. So uh, there's a lot going on. Um, water is the main ingredient. Um, so... Without opening it, I expect for um, the texture of the sauce to be pretty loose. Um, it's got some peppers, some spices, and uh, lemon. So it'd be interesting to see if there's uh, a fruit, a fruity taste that's intertwined with the spices. Let's go ahead and shake it up here. And let's go ahead and take the wrapper off. It's got a really tight black wrapper here. Hmm. I essentially have no nails. So, um, <laughs> this is proving to be a little bit more difficult than I thought it would be. Let me see. All right, I'll be right back. See if these this baby will do the trick here. All right, now it's peeling off a little bit more easier. All right, let's take one more look. That is a bright orange. Check it out one more time. It's got a regulator on here. I am not the biggest fan of those. Go ahead and take that off. Hmm. It's got a vibrant smell. All right. Let's pour it here. The spoonful. It's got a loose pour. It's got a very bright flavor excuse me, a bright texture to it. Let's see if I can show you guys here. Very bright. Can you guys see it? Try not to waste it. I don't know if you can see it. Here we go. Hmm. 
Hmm. All right. Tiny bit of heat that's on the back of my tongue. This is actually... Starting to settle a little bit in here. Um, this is this is a pretty solid everyday sauce. Um, you can put this on chicken. You can put it on pasta. Um, you can put it on rice. You can put it on eggs. Um, pretty much any any type of meat, um, seafood. Um, those type of things I, I would recommend. It is a, um, an everyday hot sauce. That's, that's the best way of putting it. Um, on my heat scale, um, I felt it immediately on the back of my tongue. It's not so much there, but it is starting uh, to subside here a little bit. I would say on my heat scale, uh, uh, a two, and that's a rounded up two. Um, but yeah, I can definitely see me using this as an everyday sauce. Again, thank you, Kim Zuber, uh, for the gift from Portugal, Bandino Piri Piri Sauce. You guys go look at it. All right, that's the review for today. See you next time.